Okay, now we're coming in to Golden Beach. This is the last of the high rises uh, before we get here. And now uh, we're in our, uh, Golden Beach, very, very, very exclusive town. Their own police force, 35 miles an hour, and you don't do 36. The homes on the other side are gorgeous. The homes on this side of the ocean are unbelievable. This is uh, 165, uh, 175 Ocean, Bo ocean Boulevard. And if you go to, I'm not sure, I don't think they have the sign uh, or the uh, thing anymore, but 461 Ocean Boulevard is where Eric uh, Clapton recorded his album uh, by the name of uh, 461 Ocean Boulevard. See the gates that are opening up. It's a private house. It's got a uh, taxi cabs of gold. And uh, some of the houses are all this way because uh, I guess it's better views this way, I think. Some amazing houses here. Here's a nice little one. Got a Jaguar driving behind me. Okay. It's a beauty. You can't really see much behind the uh, walls sometimes. Uh, there's a little five car garage or something. Here's the hedges. Three twenty five Ocean Boulevard. The house here, I'm not sure what the address is, but it's got to be right around here somewhere. Yeah, up 365 is the Strand, which is the quote public beach for the residents. It's gorgeous. I was never down there. Okay, here's a uh, big house under construction. Where you see this mother? That's a private house. Keeps going. Is 443 Ocean Boulevard. Uh, see, there's no. It's 461. This is it. 461 Ocean Boulevard. That's it. Okay. Again, this is uh, Golden Beach. I assume in the 70s it was the home of a lot of uh, drug dealers. I would guess. Now it's the home of sports stars. Uh, it's a photographer, a famous photographer, I forgot his name. He lives here. And then, see that house? And then as soon as it ends, it, it's uh, just old apartment houses and old condos in Hallandale. Not yet. Still, and then right at this street, which is County Line, this is the this is where we leave Dade. We went to Broward County, right here. Now we're in the Park Towers. All these old uh, these old condos that have been here for uh, 50, 60 years. No, not 60. Yeah, almost. Lanes here to we'll get to the bridge now. Yeah, now here's a. Well, these aren't the new ones yet. These have all been here. It's a Golden Bay Lodge right in the middle. This might be. No, it's not. These are the hemispheres, I think, or whatever they're called. Yeah, the hemispheres. They've been here for 50 years. These were the original uh, Howell Beach beachfront condos. Uh, the hemispheres. So pretty pretty fancy in its time I think and there in the back in the back far in the far distance you see uh, those are new ones the beach clubs those are at the front of the uh, Hallwell Beach Bridge and those are huge they uh, think they had trouble selling the apartments so a lot of them are rentals now and not only rentals but sort of hotel rooms uh, you can stay for four or five days I'm not sure the limit or how many days so uh, 
Mexico's private restaurant in there, and there's, uh, of course, beachfront. But we still have, right next to it, we still have a public parking lot, so you can access the beach. It's important already, because with all these buildings going up, they have to, they all have to, uh, it has to be beach access to all the places. They don't own the beach. All right, we're waiting to go over the Howlandale Beach Bridge, Howlandale Beach Boulevard. I'll show you that. See, there's still little places across the street. There's uh, ocean front. There's a pretty. Now, I'm not sure if they passed the law here like they did in New York, uh, where shell corporations, uh, you got to give the name of somebody uh, who is going to live there. To, in New York, 75% of these, and then down here, are, all these apartments are owned by shell corporations. Uh, we're in traffic, and I'll get you when we... Uh, Get to the bridge.